Welcome to Booze and Rocks, where we make cocktails for everyone. My name is David Edwards, and it's great to have you here today. We're going to make a traditionally English cocktail into something French, flowery, and gorgeous to look at. We're going to make a French gimlet. Now, you're probably wondering, how do we make it French? Well, you take the basics of simple syrup and you remove it out of the ingredients and you add a floral liqueur. Now, in this case, we're using Saint Germain, which will give us lots of floral notes and that sweetness that we need for this cocktail. So, let's get started. Now, it's a shaken cocktail, so grab your shaking glass, and we're going to start with my gin of choice for this. Now, you can use whatever style of gin that you prefer, but I'm using the Empress 1908 because it's going to give us a fantastic color that's just going to elevate it and make it absolutely gorgeous to look at, and we're going to use two ounces or 60 milliliters. If you don't have access to the Empress 1908, but you want this fantastic blue color that changes color, uh, you could actually infuse any gin that you want with butterfly pea flower tea, and that'll give you the exact same color and the exact same composition, and you don't have to worry about whether you can actually physically get this. Now, I said we're going to use Saint Germain elderflower liqueur. Use whichever one you want. Um, and you can use something that's slightly floral, something slightly sweet to give yourself a slight variation on what we're going to make here. But we're going to use an ounce and a half or 45 milliliters. Now, this is already turning into a gorgeous, gorgeous color, but we're not done yet. We need a little bit of citrus, and for that we're going to use a little bit of lime juice. So grab your lime, and what we'll do is we will cut this in half, cut a slice out for our garnish, and squeeze half an ounce or 15 milliliters into the glass. That looks fantastic. So what we'll do now is we're going to add a little bit of ice to this, and we're going to take this for a good 10 to 15 seconds, just to make sure that we get a really good dilution and chill it all the way. So make sure that you put this on, give it a slap so you get a good seal, give it a flip, and shake it with a smile. So what you want to do is now pop this off and put this off to the side because you're going to serve this in something kind of nice, kind of elegant, kind of fancy, or put it in a rocks glass. It's up to you. But what you definitely want to do is make sure that you double strain out any of the pulp from the lime or any ice crystals. Oh, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous to look at. So grab your lime slice, put it on top like so, and here you have a French gimlet. Absolutely gorgeous to look at. Let's try it out. Mm. Oh yeah, you get the gin, you get a little bit of that elderflower liqueur, so you get those gorgeous floral notes. It's just sweet enough, and the hints of lime pull it all together. If you like this style of cocktail, definitely take a look right here.